here we are at Westover. Here is all of your properties. Neighbors have been really friendly. I actually had to wait for a showing to complete, so I got to sit here on the porch and see everyone come by. That is actually your cellar. They are PCSing to Pensacola. Um, he does anesthesia, I believe, for the Navy. Um, she also let me know that they have been renting uh, rooms, posting on a bulletin board here at the hospital, and have been renting rooms to medical students, which has been very lucrative since they have that third floor set up. So, super nice porch. She said she hasn't had any issues with street parking. And come on in. Beautiful hardwoods. Tall ceilings here throughout. Your uh, formal dining they have set up as a little office area. These are sliding doors as well. I actually am not quite sure how to use them, but you do have a storm door here on the front for some natural light. Actually, your traditional door also. Wood-burning fireplace. a sitting area they have set up as like a little bar area to head to the upstairs little collectors suite here under the stairs wine bottles continuing on I love how tall the ceilings are here you can see zoom out a little bit Another entrance, it looks like, to the upstairs. Laundry with a guest bathroom here on the first floor. Oh, let's head on down. basement so lots of room for extra storage down here water heater is down here and also an entrance from the exterior kitchen. Lots of cabinets. Storage space. Looks to be Corian potentially countertops. Yeah, I believe it is. Yep. All solid surface. You can see space and this is a three season room so it's warm in the summer but she told me that they run heaters and things in the winter and it's super nice springtime with the windows open which they have them cracked now it's not too bad in here a little bar area Another little bar area they have out here. And 
it's like a nice little Japanese maple. Right, so exterior wise, we are looking at a hundred year old home, but our HVAC system actually looks to be newer and intact. Um, a little bit of peeling paint here and here on the wood the seal, but nothing too, too bad. And there is an um, option here for access. I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not, but it looks like they have a little bit of storage on this door right here. Cute rope swing, I didn't see that. Another little storage spot. Looks like they have bicycles, lawn equipment. And it looks like another little door for access under the porch. Okay, let's head on in and head upstairs. Here we are back in the kitchen. So we'll go up these stairs first. We'll call this bedroom one. This is on the back of the house. A little bit of cracking here. Again, we are in a hundred year old home. A little bit of a paint difference there. But she did mention that they had replaced the roof recently. So that could be a result of some old water damage. Small little closet here. And it continues on. There. I love the old doors. Lots of character. So you do have some movement in the flooring. That is normal in the sage home. But just something to kind of keep an eye on. Clawfoot tub. mode and sink. This is a large bedroom. This may be, may be the master because it is connected to the bathroom. We will see here in a moment. A little bit of settlement there that I can see. A little more actually as we get closer. And a secondary closet. Oh. This one is stuck. I don't want to yank on it, but we can ask about that. I love the architectural detail in here. Oh, little coat closet. Bookshelf. And a, oh, nope, here we go. You could potentially list it as a second master with that bathroom being connected to that bedroom. Oh, good size closet. Okay, so that door runs into the other room. So they had knocked this out, would be my assumption, to add in a larger closet. Here we go. Got some extra little storage there. Good size shower, commode, storage. 
two shower heads. Could use maybe a cleaning and or retiling. It looks like the grout's just actually missing there. So getting that redone. It is nice and clean though. So there is another little closet space. Could do shoes, uniforms. A little bit of cracking in the ceiling again. That is normal. I do love these windows. Tons of natural light in this room. You do have your own little fireplace too. Looks like they have a decorative ornament in there right now. Beautiful doors. Look at these. All right, let's continue on up the stairs. So this is the area that she was telling me they rent out to medical students. She says they don't really see them a whole lot because of their schedule. Full large walk-in closet. It is a little warmer up here, but that could be that they don't have Maybe a window unit plugged in because they don't currently have a tenant. But it does have a little kitchen area. So they kind of keep to themselves. Oh, there is, a, there is a unit here. It just probably isn't on high. Oh yeah, it's only set to 77. Bathroom, shower. All right, I, I do like this one. My only concerns I would say is just the age of the home, but with what we've been looking at, they've all been older. So I feel like you are knowledgeable of what to expect with an older home. Um, I know it doesn't have a garage like you were hoping, but I think overall this is a good one and very close to the area that you've been seeking. Let me know your thoughts.